All right. So, here we are in a new test beta branch of Miss Survival. Let's jump in and check it out. What's up, guys and gals? Welcome to the Outer Middle Show. Mad Vlad is the name, and Miss Survival is the game. And in today's episode, like I said, we're checking out the new branch to Miss Survival. Now, this is in early access, very, very, very early access. It's basically just a way for players to help the creators test what they've been working on. That's exactly what we're going to do. This could be bad. I don't know. Because the last time they updated this game, I wasn't completely blown away. There was a lot of problems. A lot of lag. Just, uh, oh my, oh, what is this? Why is this happening? Uh, uh, oh, uh, yeah, very, very jittery. Let's go into the options and see if we can change some things. Okay. <laughs> We changed some things, and it kind of didn't help. Open buildings and structure, craft menu by pressing B. Okay, it doesn't seem to be lagging like it was before. Um, yeah. For many of you that don't know, we just finished Sons of the Forest Hard Survival, if you want to check that out. It's back there somewhere. Uh, yeah, I want to start a brand new series on this game but i don't think it's ready more or less we're just jumping in and checking out what's new the map looks familiar though which kind of confuses the crap out of me yeah this is extremely confusing i don't understand why the creators of this game would completely change the game like they have over the past couple updates, man. It's like they had something good going and then they completely changed the map. I just don't understand that. I mean, I get you want to upgrade the game, but why not just add to it? Unless there's like a catastrophic failure where, you know, adding something crashes the game or like you have to start from scratch, start over, all that. I understand that, but this game's been in development for years. I was, I think I was the first person to play this game uh, on YouTube. And uh, since, I feel like we've gone backwards. <laughs> anyway, let's just check out what's new. This is the old map. This has to be the old map. It looks very similar. Okay. Check out this department store. I don't, I don't see any new building, ugh, buildings just yet. The running seems about the same. Uh, none. Interact with door. <laughs> None. You can't go in there, bruh. Let's check out the vehicles. What can we do? None. We can't even get into the trunk. Install tire. None. What does none mean? Do we need something to open the trunk? Or is nothing functional? I don't know if anything's functional. Okay. Let's run around the map and uh, see what we can find. Uh, maybe we'll find some enemies. I hear the enemies are upgraded. Ooh. Yeah, I don't remember seeing a house like that. That must be new. Impressive? Eh. I don't know. Not really. Le oh. Oh. None open. None open. That's his name. Mr. None open. Ready to dock. Ready to dock. What do we have? Trailers now? I'm excited about that. I need a weapon. I need some sort of weapon. Okay, I did something within the menu, and now it's running great. I basically full screened it, and everything started working beautifully. It was on, like, windowed full or something. I don't know. But it's working better now. God, the draw distance is so terrible. Now, I don't want to dog this game, okay? I understand this is in early access after many years. <laughs> and this is new. What am I hearing? Why do I hear a heartbeat? Oh, it's one of those things. Can we get in here? What? We can't jump in there? Uh, fill propane bottle. 
No way. Propane bottle not found. Can't carry. Your fishing rod is not ready. Yeah, it's one of those big globs that has a heartbeat. That's disturbing as hell. Let's go in here and poke it. That is disgusting. You got... I, I don't know what this is, but it's got a lot of bones in it. It's really weird looking. Not a fan of that model. Could have done better with that. Let's see if we can pick up food. Man, we can't do nothing. Yeah, it doesn't look like we're going to get to use anything, which sucks. Because we can't pick nothing up. I think all we can do is literally just run around the map and check out what's new. This kind of seems like the... What was that? Oh, there's the new monsters, dude. They look pretty good. They look a lot better than the old ones. No way, dude. Yeah, they got some character now. They're different. I like that. Oh, frig. That's a bear. Yep, I'm backing up, Mr. Bear Man. You know, it's not fair to be a bear. We're just going to walk around that. Apparently, bears are in the club because they're not getting attacked. Whoa, dude, look at that. Yeah, this is the old map. It has to be. It's the old map with added stuff to it. Which, I like that. I like the old map better. The new map, man, was just too glitchy. And uh, there was that. There was one monster. It was a new monster they put in there. I can't remember the name of it, but it had massive claws like on its mouth. I hated that thing. That thing sucked. It was just OP, man. I want to get chased by those things, but I do not want to piss off a bear. That I do not want to do. This kind of looks like it's going to be a bandit camp. Although I don't know because I can't go in here. Let's see. Oh, look at this. Can we get in here? <gasps> I made it. You know what's weird? Now, I heard I heard rumor that this is Unreal Engine 5. But I'm not feeling Unreal Engine 5 vibes. I can't really tell a difference. You know what I mean? If it's going to be on Unreal Engine 5 or what? It certainly doesn't feel or look like Unreal Engine 5. All right. Well, let's uh, leave the hole in the wall and travel down this road. One thing I want to see really bad is the movement of the new enemies. I know in The Infected, which is a series that I literally could not finish because the game was that bad. Uh, that game needs a lot of work. A lot of people questioned why I quit playing that game in the middle of a series. It's because the game was so unfunctional that I just could not handle it anymore. That game's going to have to update more before I play it. But one thing I want to see is the new enemies, how they move. That's a four-wheeler. Or an ATV. Okay, I hear breathing. Oh, wow. This place is packed. I hope their movement's cool. We're about to find out. Hey, guys. Hey. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, I just pooped. I pooped a little bit. Okay, he went back inside. That was terrifying. I like that much. Kind of like the old monsters, though. Wow. A little bit of dookie shot out there. It's okay. I'm all right. Calm down. I didn't take any damage, though. Let's see our stats. Our health is all the way up. I don't think we can get hurt. God, that was scary. Oh, my God. Oh! Yeah, that's terrifying. You cannot outrun them. I don't like that. Wow. Yeah, you get you get in their line of sight. And you better run. You better turn around and run. I kind of like that. I actually really like that. I don't like being able to outrun something that's inhuman. You know? You either have a gun ready to go. Or you turn around the second you see them running at you. And try to get away. 
Look at him. Where'd that girl go? God, that girl is terrifying. Look at him. Oh my God. Oh man, they their detection is so far away. Look, watch. They'll see me. All they got to do is glance your way. You're toast. I wish I could like let a big fart. Oh, one took off running. Where's he going? Oh shit! Oh, he hit me. That bastard hit me. That took some of my health. Oh well. At least I'm not damaged. That yeah, that's scary. That's very very scary. I see myself pooping a little in the future. God. It's going to be a while before they get this polished. Like a long time. I, I give it like a year at least to even make this playable. Mm, cool. This is interesting. So I hit pause for a second and hit unpause as you can see or we can hit continue. And the, the menu is still up. That's fantastic. I dig that. So now you, you know, it feels like you're always paused. Man, I can't interact with anything, dude. I don't know if this is new or at some point in this branch test you were able to pick stuff up or open stuff. I have no idea. But this is uh, very, very bad. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I just figured out that <laughs> in the menu, if you go to settings, if you're trying to play on this branch, none of your keys are set. You have to set all of your keys. At least that was the case for me. That's why anytime I tried to pick something up or interact with something, it didn't work. So let's see if it works now. Yes, it does work. <laughs> okay. What in the hell even is this? This is nice. This is kind of like the infected. I think. Don't we have a cart in infected? Why don't I know these things? Anyway. All right. Now we can properly test this. All right, so we've got a little cart for moving supplies. I'm assuming we can carry that wherever we go. We should carry that wherever we go to uh, carry supplies and whatnot. Tell you what, we'll carry it with us this entire playthrough. All right, pick up a can of beef. Can we now? We can't access the inventory. What about tab? No. Okay, we got to set that. Okay, there we go. Nice. Now we're looking sexy. Okay, now we can search things. I'm assuming now we can open trunks. Yes, we can. Look what we have here. A shotgun. What a find. All right. Man, I was so worried. I was like, man, this sucks. I was bummed. Let's see what this looks like. Damn, we got to set that too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Now I'm getting a little excited. Now I'm feeling the fairies dance inside my underwear. All right, let's grab this and let's let's move on. Let's continue down the road. As a matter of fact, let's go back to where we were. I want to check that stuff out. Why do I feel like I'm running faster with this thing? Maybe I should get one of these in real life. Run around the block a couple times. <laughs> Feels like I'm flying. Gives me a sense of empowerment. That is, of course, unless you fall. Then you're screwed. Whatever's in your cart is going to weigh down the wheels. And those wheels are going to pop off and put you in Snap City. Why is everything floating? Holy crap. All the rocks and sticks are floating. Am I floating? I am floating. Oh, I'm back on the ground. Okay. <laughs> what is going on? Got us another hunting tower. This is great. Let's check this out. You stay there, buddy. It's all right. We've got a shotgun just in case. Ooh, that's an ATV wheel. Can I carry that, please? Come on. Yes. Yes. Uh, let's see if I can put that in here. Put it right there. <laughs> we're going to build us an ATV, baby. Anything in here? No, we're clear. 
All right. Well, let's search the joint. Oh, we got some food and some salt. I don't know why I'm picking up salt. I don't know, man. Maybe we'll try to do a series on this test branch. Just for, you know, for shiz and gigs. I mean, it's extremely broken. But sometimes that's what makes a game fun. And I hope you guys like my new camera angle and my new green screen thing that I got going on. Uh, one thing's for sure. If we are going to play this for a day, propane. I, ne I need to test that. Uh, we're going to need to find shelter. We need to get serious with this. Let's continue on down the road. See what we can find. My draw distance is absolutely terrible. I've got it set really low for performance, you know. But it's terrible. I've got a shotgun. I don't know if I've got ammunition. I want to pop off some rounds and explode some kneecaps. I've been itching to do that for a while. A lot of the games I play don't have guns. What is this place? Have I been here? Hopefully it's not a bandit camp. I get my head blown off. Ooh, an axe. Yes. I'll just leave that chain there. Propane. You know what? One of my favorite things about Survive the Nights, which is another game we're going to do a series on, is... What the hell is that? Are those cubs? Dude, that scared the ever-loving crap out of me. They have baby bear cubs in here now. That's really cool. Where's the mama bear? Where'd the cubs go? Ooh, ammunition. Yes! Shotgun ammo. Uh, where did the cubs go? Or am I stupid? Where? Oh, there they are. Where is the mama bear? Hello, Mr. Cubbies. Where's your mommy? I would blow you away, but you're extremely cute. Yeah, well, the mama bear probably isn't too far behind. There we go. We've got two wheels now. There's a car off in the distance. I want to get away from these cubs, man. I'm not trying to die. Let's reload. See how this works. It says that I've got two bullets. Reload. There we go. Ooh, it's Popal's shotgun. It's a single shot. All right, man. Let's get the hell out of here. Let's fly away. Oh, there's the mama bear. Sitting there waiting for us. <gasps> Dude. There's a lot of bears. What are we supposed to do? I got to get around these guys. Yeah, we're just going to go around. For na like now, for some reason, it's moving. It's like so smooth. It, it hasn't had a single hiccup since I've got the settings right. <gasps> what is that? That is a... Wait a minute, dude. Are those palm trees? I think this is the motel. It is. But why are there palm trees? This looks a lot more open. Man, I'm so confused, dude. Is this not the old map? No, this definitely isn't the same. This is a much bigger place. I think this is new, actually. Because, I don't know, it looks familiar. But then again, it don't. Let's pull out our shoddy, just in case. We've got two bullets. No, I remember this. I just can't remember which. Ah, I'm confused. Anyway, it looks good. Check these rooms. I need some more ammo. Yeah, it looks good. This kind of looks like a Disney resort. Only a lot dirtier. Ooh, these are the bigger, nicer hotels. There is nothing here, dude. This place is completely barren. There is nothing here. There's no enemies, there's no items, there's no bullets. It's just a blank sheet. Yeah, this place sucks. I'm going to the gas station. I know there's some goodies at the gas station. Another thing about this game that I cannot stand for the life of me is the fall damage. The fall damage in this game is, it's insulting to say the least. I'm not gonna forget my four-wheeler wheels. 
Let's go across the street and see what we can find. So far, I'm, I'm kind of digging it, you know? I don't have high hopes because the two major updates this game had, man, really disappointed me, and it confused me more than anything. But uh, I think I just heard something. Yeah, there's something here. Something's in the gas station. But I don't know. We'll see, man. I'm optimistic. Kind of. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. I'm only seeing one guy. Get it back, get it back. Oh my god! <sighs> A dinky ball flew out of my stank muffin. That was scary. How did a shotgun not absolutely torch his face off? The gunshot sounds are fantastic. Okay, well, we're officially out of ammunition. <laughs> Ooh -wee. Okay, we got some goodies in here. Let's search this guy. Hey, Vlad, don't forget to search him. There's nothing on him, okay? Chill out. So what'd you do today, Vlad? Well, I rummaged through the apocalypse. It was very lonely and scary at some times. And, uh, it smelt funny. Can we check stuff while... Oh my god! Okay. Let's, uh, reload this. It's alright, we only got two bullets, but that's better than nothing. All right, gas station. And Taylor, we meet again. Let's head down the road. All right, dude. Looky here. We got us a gas station with a nice truck in it. I like it. The Golden Gasoline Service. What does that mean? Does that mean their gasoline is really pee pee? I don't know. I'll tell you what, they do a great job. Ooh, definitely gonna need that. At the, the building models, you know, they they look good, but it doesn't look like freshly post-apocalyptic. It kind of looks like old Appalachia. You know what I mean? Like, it reminds me of literally here. There's towns that are abandoned that look like this, uh, but they've been abandoned for a very, very long time. So I'm assuming that this game based on the aesthetics of all the buildings and stuff that uh this has been going on for quite some time possibly like multiple years maybe this isn't like fresh post-apocalyptic shit but you know the aesthetics are are good the models are great look it's uh it's the diner why would we need mustard we could pick up ketchup and mustard. Maybe if a zombie gets close to us, we can squirt him in the eye with some mustard. I don't know. I really want to get one of these four-wheelers up and running. Like, really bad. Yeah, the probably my favorite buildings are the gas stations in this game. They nailed those. But, man, dude. You talk about some old ass gas pumps, bro. That's like those gas pumps are easily like 40s, 50s gas pumps. They're not modern, that's for sure. Which makes me question the year. I mean, they're they're what is it M4s? I'm just trying to accurately predict the year and you know what they're going for here. The gas stations, though, like. They look cool, but are they accurate? I don't know. They look cool, though. Definitely old-timey gas stations. I love these buildings. They're nice. There's a map. We didn't set the map. Wait a minute. No way. Nah, man. There's no way, dude. Th dude, this is... What? I need a pencil. I need to find a pencil. This is the old map. Yeah, I don't think they changed the maps yet because this is the old map and we are not on the old map. And if we are, 
then I am stupid. Okay, well, okay. Let's, let's just move on. Yeah, we're not on the old map. There's no way. Because we come to high points, and before... Wait a minute. Bruh, am I tripping? I must be tripping. I keep getting turned around. Let's, let's just keep going down this road. Hopefully we find an ATV. Oh, no. What am I hearing? Oh, no. Uh-oh, mist is here. What am I supposed to do? Holy crap. I think I'm just going to stay up here. Got a baseball bat. Ooh. I'm just noticing this. These crates. Hang on just a second. Can we beat through these? Oh, that's cool. There's nothing in them, though. I'm a little scared. Why are these doors made of glass? I'm thinking it's because the mist creatures are able to see see us through them? I, I don't know. But I don't like it. Ooh, ammunition. It's for a revolver. Uh, I think we're safe here, though. I think. Maybe sleep? Can we still do that? Okay. I just changed the key. Oh, there we go. Let's sleep for one hour. Come on, baby. Yep, they're still out here. Let's try again. There we go. Gee whiz. We're Gucci, man. Let's search the rest of this building. I don't know. I'm liking it so far. It's so much smoother. I, I hope they don't screw that up. Because I think that was literally the worst part about the game before is the lag. The lag was so damn bad. It was unbearable in some spots. And I don't know. So <laughs> it was just rumor. I'm, I'm assuming that this is Unreal Engine 5. It, this is not Unreal Engine 5. There's no way. So whoever told me that, shame on you. Oh, okay. We're back at the beginning. This is where we started. All right. So now I know where I'm at. And there's the tunnel. There's nothing in the tunnel. So we'll just wrap around this road and go straight. If we find a pencil, we'll see if we can locate ourselves on the map, which I highly doubt that that's an updated map. Okay, we're going to go back to this barn where we got chased. See if we can flatline a couple of them. Get a well-placed headshot. We're going to try. Go ahead and put this here. I think there's an ATV over here, too. I can't remember where I saw that one. But we've got two tires. I don't know what else is required. All right, man. Let's whip it out. Let's see. What do we got for the shoddy? Absolutely nothing. So we got two shots. And uh, I'm thinking there's more than two in there. Yep, there's the four-wheeler. I just pooped on myself. Nope. I don't trust it. He chased me all the way out here. God, they're so fast. All I got to do is get a nice placement. Get one running at me, maybe? Here we go. And we were on burst fire. Fantastic. Well, at least it killed it. It's a double headshot. I'm going to search his body. Oh, yeah. We got some Mr. Pib. We can't carry it, though. We need to find a backpack to expand our inventory. Well, <laughs> we got a double headshot. I forgot to check to see what firing mode I was in. It's okay. It happens. Yes, sir. And we did. I'm getting rid of this mustard. And we've got some bolts, too. Ooh, a t-shirt. Let's put a shirt on this man. Damn, he's ripped. Torso. There we go. Now we've got a t-shirt. We're just running around in our underwear. Fantastic. We got four shots now. Uh, I don't know how to change the firing modes or if, if you even can. So we're just going to leave that one alone. Maybe it's... Uh, ooh, a poopy. Maybe it's set to burst fire and you can't change it. Who knows? 
So, uh, congratulations on the enemies. They are a lot, like, a lot better. They are pretty crazy. Very terrifying. There's one upstairs glitching out, kind of. Come on. There you go, buddy. Oh my god. That took multiple headshots. Whoa! God, that's scary. Oh, here comes another one. I got one shot. Yep, and I'm gone. Maybe pull out my baseball bat. Hit us a home run, maybe. Why is he still running? Okay, he stopped. Let's check this body. Pretty... Oh, God, that would hurt. Can you imagine getting hit with a wooden baseball bat with the power of this swing? I mean, usually when you swing a baseball bat, you don't hear the wind off of it. Like this. That's some serious impact speed. All right, here we go. We're going to test it. Where the hell did he go? He must have had to use the bathroom. The hell? <laughs> I'm ready to knock one out of the park. Come on, baby. Come on, you see me. Turn that stupid head of yours. Come on. I don't want to go too far in because I'll get that dude's attention. Hello, sir. I just clocked his face. Let's check our health. Yeah, we're half health. That hurt really bad. I don't want to die yet. Let's check and see. I think sleeping is what regens our health, but I'm not sure. Yeah, I don't want to chance it. That was a fun experience nonetheless. One thing I've learned is never eat or drink even remotely close to an enemy. Because they will appear in front of you and smack you right in the face. It's not fun. Alright, we're going to move along down the road. See what we can find. We desperately need ammunition. Ooh. Look at this. This is interesting. It's like some toxic waste plant or something. There's probably nothing in it, though. Usually never is. It's probably going to be a bear building. Uh, okay. Definitely a bear building. Usually the big buildings that look the most interesting have zero loot in them. Just pass those up. All right, we're coming up on a house and a church. A couple houses. This is a nice setting. Looks very aesthetically pleasing. Gives me butterflies. Oh man, yeah, this is like a whole town. This is really cool. I'm not running because my stamina is low. Or was low. So, just building it back up. You know, taking in the sights. It's a nice little palm tree out front. Yeah, th dude, this looks like something in the Appalachian Mountains. For sure. This is crazy. It's like my backyard... Found a little bit of ammo. I'm wondering if there's any bandit camps in the test branch. Uh oh. Oh no. It's raining. Hope it's not like Sons of the Forest where it rains every five seconds. Let's grab our cart. Carrying around some ATV wheels. <laughs> it's okay. We're not that weird. I got a feeling one of these houses is going to have some a-holes in it. Yep, and this is our house. Oh, my God. Are you serious? Oh, no, and the sun's not out, so I think we're... Oh, yeah, we're screwed. We are screwed. Let's reload. Oh, my God. Okay, so when it rains, you want to be extremely careful. If I didn't have those three bullets, I would have been toast. That really sucked. Stupid bastard. Didn't have anything either. Oh, man. Dude. This is not good. I'm out of ammunition. Again. I need a revolver. You know what? I've got some shotgun ammo, I think. 
I've got three bird shots. And we're going to use them point blank. Right in their mouth. Yeah, man, I don't remember. I don't even remember it raining in this game before. But apparently now when it rains, they can just, you know, leave the house and... Oh my god, the shotgun is loud. Wow. Yeah, come and get a taste. Come on. Yep. Yep. Yeah, come on. Damn! I took a hit. My health is low. Fucking bottle of pills. What a junkie. Yo, crank yankers. He's got a cigarette. You know what? I'll take that cigarette. I'm a little stressed out. Need some nicotine. Alright, I think that's all of them. I hope that's all of them. Because if not, and I get smacked one more time, I'm done so. Let's reload. Just in case. Yes, sir. What a good find. See, one of those zombinoids I took out with one headshot. It must have been extremely well placed. Second dude, not so much. Took two headshots, which I don't like. I heard the crunch on all shots, but yeah, that was kind of confusing. Let's see if anybody's up here. Oh my God. Let's pie this corner. Okay, I think we're Gucci. Yes, yes, six shots. That is what I'm talking about. Dude, it's like Christmas. We have to trade our cigarette, unfortunately. Our lungs will thank us later. I'm taking that. I'm actually enjoying myself right now. This is cool. This is dope. It's been a while since I've enjoyed myself on this game. Given all the crazy stuff they've been doing to it. This feels like the old mist. With some perks. And this is like... Super early access. Or test branch, or whatever you want to call it. So it's like nowhere near complete. Ooh, key card required. Interesting. Aha. Uh -huh. There's some goodies in there. Alright, so I'm assuming we're at a military bunker. We need to find a key card to get in got to be around here somewhere right there we go okay yeah we can still move stuff we can pick up storage containers and collect them where is that key card it's got to be here somewhere you know what I'm thinking I'm wondering if the new monsters can actually climb now because before you could just get up on some shipping containers and be fine I wonder if they can jump up there and smack you I don't know I need to find some gasoline for this generator. wonder what that does. wonder if that, like, turns on all the lights and stuff here. Oh, wow. Oh. Yeah, we got, uh, we got some ammunition now. We're looking tasty. What is that? Another M4. We've already got one. There's a Kniff. Don't need that at the moment. I love roaming around in the apocalypse. It's so fun. So many adventures. I'm glad you guys can come with me. Oh my. <laughs> I wish I could find a revolver. Ooh, boots. Yes, sir. So we got underwear, <laughs> t shirt, boots. To start. These little things are loaded, dude. Absolutely loaded. Oh, I see. You take the little canisters and you can fill up the bigger canisters. That's cool. Ooh, yeah, baby. SWAT helmet. Bandages. More shotgun rounds, sir. Dude, we are looking insane right now. 
Let's put this on. And we got a helmet. All we need is some damn pants. We'll be fine. Let's go to the top. See what we can see. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Ooh, yes. Lock pick. Damn it. I should have picked up that lock pick. There's definitely some goodies in here. Ooh, a pencil. Yes, 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 yes. Pick it up. All right, let's see where we are on the map. Let's hit M. Current location. That's what I thought. The new map is not on here. Okay. Yep, this is the old map. So, we don't know where we are. It's okay. It's all right. We don't need to know. Boy, oh boy. Those were some good finds. But we got to move on. Ooh, wait a minute. What's this? Is there something up here? No, I don't think so. Oh, well. Bro. I keep finding stuff. Apocalyptic poopies. All right, that's enough jacking around. Let's get out of here. Look at this road, man. This looks cool. Ah, uh, I want to take the side quest. Let's take side quest road. You know, if I ever get to name a street, that's what I'm going to name it. Side quest street. I'm going to save the game. I haven't saved the game yet. That looks like an outpost. Yeah, I think we just ran across an outpost. We're about to find out. So if the monsters are in this game, the different zombies, there's got to be NPCs. Got to be. I don't see any movement. That's definitely abandoned outpost. Okay, let's reload. See what we can see. Let's go covert. Don't see anything. Running. Slow and methodical. We're going to be as a splinter cell. Let's go. Get cover behind this tree. The NPCs do not miss in this game, bro. If you've ever played Mist and you come across an NPC, they are dangerous. And they cheat. Is that a flag? What kind of flag is that? I see a mannequin with some a nice upper body rack. I think that's a mannequin. I hope that's a mannequin. I'm not for sure, but I think something's moving in this window, but I can't tell. Yeah, I'm not seeing anybody, dude. They might not have the NPCs on here yet. Let's go up real quick. See what we can see. I want to double check. Make sure so we don't get shot in the face. That would have been real funny had I ran up here and there was somebody up here. Yeah, nothing. Yeah, I think it's clear. It's definitely clear. All right, man. Let's get down. Let's check the place. Oh my God, that fire scared me. Nice upper body rack. Nice hip section too. Mannequin approved. I swear to God, if I get shot, dude, I'm going to blame it on you, the viewer. Yeah, this, this all looks very familiar. That is a terrible flag. I don't like that. That looks stupid. Need better flags. Get on that. <laughs> okay, it's definitely clear. And if I get shot, again, it's your all's fault. I take no responsibility. Let's check the house. Yeah, dude. No, nah, man. I know this bandit cap, dude. I know this camp. I don't know. I think that uh, either these are set up similarly as, like, I don't know. I'm tripping, dog. I remember having a massive war at a bandit camp just like this one. Like, it was laid out exactly like this one. Ooh-wee. This place looks nice. They for real have a Coca-Cola machine in here? You guys might want to change that. You might get in trouble for that. Yeah, it looks like there's like no loot at these camps. 
Like none whatsoever. Yeah, there's no loot here. Therefore, yeah, it's impossible for us to do a series on this game. That's what sucks about it, man. I really wanted to do another series, but it's not ready yet. Hmm. Mom's spaghetti. Looks like Morgan was here. Left his trademark signature calling sign. Three meatballs. Well, that sucks. I guess let's get out of here. There's literally, literally nothing here. A magical floating telephone pole. Interesting. I do love this cart, though. I'm really digging it. And I'm going to build one in real life. And I'm going to use it everywhere I go. I'm going to take it to the grocery store. <laughs> I'm going to go fishing with it. Hunting with it. It's going to be a hoot. Did that road just come to an end? It did. We're still on the side quest here. And found another house. There is probably some goons in here. Thank God it's not raining. There's an ATV right there. That's ours. That is ours. We only got two wheels. Need two more. Wait a minute, dude. <laughs> no way. Come on. No. No. It is, man. It's the old mist house. We freaking accidentally ran into it. And there's the survival garage. Oh, man. Memories, dude. We're back. Holy crap. The survival garage. We got to find Rachel. This place looks a little different, but... It's the same. This is the old map. How did I not recognize? It's obviously changed a bit. Yeah, definitely changed a bit. But, yeah. This is it, man. This is the old house. I've got to claim it, man. I have to. <laughs> Sorry. This is my active base now. Look, what the crap? <laughs> Oh, man. So many memories. I remember when Rachel was in here. Zomboids were kicking in the windows and she was screaming to high heaven. Our pictures are still here. You know what would be dope? If the devs put a picture of me drawn by a child on this refrigerator. Me and Rachel. That'd be awesome. All right. <sighs> See, I don't, I can't remember if this was a corn mill before or what. I don't remember this being here. I remember something being back here. I think it was a water tower. There is a generator on the house, bro. This makes me smile, man. This really does. We got a mailbox now. <sighs> Rachel's going to love this. So, okay, so if this is the same map and I know where I'm at now, let's, uh, Wander up here. Yeah, man. Here's the military base. Yep. This is the old map. Why Why are they going back and forth between maps? I don't understand that. I really don't get it. That confuses the hell out of me. Like, I loved this map. I'm pretty sure everybody loved this map. But that other map, man, it was just, I don't know. It was too confusing. And there was there was no feng shui to it. You know what I mean? All right, I'm going to leave this here. There's got to be ATV wheels. There's supposed to be a lot of stuff here. Oh, God. Oh, no. I don't remember there being goons here. Well, we're going to have to smoke them. Let's use the shoddy. I hope he does. I hope he doesn't open doors. There's two of them. Or no, I think he just went downstairs. Yeah. Okay. 
Where is he at? He is right by the back door. Knock, knock. Knock, knock. Bullshit. That didn't kill him. Hello, sir. How are you this afternoon? Oh, God. What is he doing? I'm glad I didn't pull the trigger. What is he doing? Okay, that was weird. That was weird. He did some crazy stuff, made me miss a couple times. Is this an over under? This is now this is Papal shotgun. Yes, a revolver. Damn it, I can't pick it up. Man, we really need a backpack. Okay. Let's uh, put this in one of our quick slots. There we go. Now we've got Papal shotgun, the over under. That is what I'm talking about. I need me a good over under shotgun. I don't have one. What is that? That is a suppressor. Yeah, we don't need that. Bullet. Ooh wee. Ooh. Looking good, man. Now that we've got that revolver, that opens up the door for a lot more head splody possibilities. Okay. Looks like we're having a bit of trouble here. Here we go. The shotgun sound effects, man, so far are my favorite thing. Sounds amazing. That's what I loved about Survive the Nights, man. The game was so bad at one point in time. And I tore the new rear end. And then they made it so memeable that it was just fun to play. It feels good now that we know we have a place to uh, hang our hat. The survival garage is about the safest place you can be. So we'll go there for the night. Our stats are getting kind of low. And uh, yeah. This was a success. Now that I know where I'm at on the map... It makes me want to explore some other places just to make sure that this is... The, well, I know this is the same map, but I want to travel around and see if they've left some of the landmarks up. Where is my cart? I'm going to leave the cart at the house now that I know where I'm at. Wow. <laughs> I didn't check this place. Finding a lot of ammo. Okay. Okay. I don't know where. What was that? Okay, we can break that for parts. Okay. Where is my cart? There it is. Damn, it's way back here. All right, we've made it back home. I'm going to go ahead and pull this in the shed. We're going to close the garage doors. We're going to go to sleep right here. There we go. Let's sleep about ooh we I don't like that sound let's go back to sleep oh my god it's two o'clock in the morning okay we've eat let's sleep for one more hour there we go top of the morning any jank anchors out here nope we've got a four-wheeler here so now we don't have to really hunt for one that's fantastic. I'm going to go ahead and put the wheels on it. Let's open up the survival garage. Let's see how we do this. That didn't work. Aha. <laughs> uh -huh. There we go. 30 minutes for each wheel. Okay, we got our rear wheels put on. Let's proceed. Hell yeah. Let's take our cart. Let's go up the road. Let's see if the lake is still here. Or... It's more or less like a pond, but whatever. There's a bunch of log cabins. Well, should be a bunch of log cabins over here. And there they are. They're still here. Can't believe this is the old map, man. This is fantastic. Usually a lot of good loot in here, but we got to be careful. Probably some jank smokers in here. And now we have Papaw's shotgun. Yep, I hear one. We're doubly as dangerous. Ooh, see him? I don't know if there's one or two of them in there. Just one. 
Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. God, man. Those things are so scary. There's our bow. And I threw away our freaking arrows. Oh well. Nope, oh, there's some arrows. I wonder if the backpacks are in the same place. Oh yeah, he's got some drankity drank up off on him. I'm gonna go ahead and drink it. Alright, moving on. Now we can see if the big barns are still here. That's kind of a grip up the road, but you talk about some loot dog. Some hella loot dog. That's no cap on top of that thing. Shizzy, bro. And I know for a fact there's a bandit camp right here. Yep, right there. Oh my god, I just saw somebody moving. Yep, there is a bandit camp right up here. You have got to be kidding me. Alrighty then, it's time, baby. It's time to get loose. Shh, you gotta be quiet, guys, alright? I know I'm your favorite YouTuber, but you gotta be quiet. Don't wanna get me killed, do you? Because then I can't make no more videos. It's already hard enough for me to make videos. Okay, see one dude. There's two guys. There's probably more than two. The second I pull this trigger, they're going to go ape Scheisenheiser. Let's be careful. There might only be two. There's three. Great, dude. I could have killed them all just now. All right. Well, I'm pretty sure there's only three. We have plenty of ammo. If we just pick our shots, we'll be okay. These guys are ridiculously accurate. One dead. Two dead. Three dead. Now let's make sure that we're okay. Let's reload. Make sure that was all of them. Usually if there's more... They're running around freaking out, but I have had some instances where one will get stuck in a corner, and then you run right into him, and he headshots you immediately. It's not fun. So we're still going to take our time. <laughs> that dude's got his hand up. What's up, dog? What's cracking, man? He's all right. He's alive. He's just He's just faking it. Okay, let's check him. What do you have on you, sir? Let's check your backpack. You had nothing? Oh, you're broke. These are some broke bandits. Yeah, that's got to be all of them. All right, man. Ooh, yes, sir. I will take those shotgun rounds. All right, what do you have? Spread eagle, man. Got a grenade fragment, an apple. This must have been the Apple Gang. They're broke. It's okay. Okay, that freaked me out. <laughs> so that means Rachel's here. We've got to find Rachel. Yes, I am definitely going to take this. I'm not going to be cutting down any trees, I don't think, in this episode. So, Oh, yes. Yes, got an ACOG. Well, that's our first bandit camp. Completely destroyed. That brought back some memories as well, too. Okay. So I think the last place we're going to visit right now is the old gas station. It's right down the road. And then, well, no, the last place we'll visit is the barns. See, now that I know that we're on the old map, the old new map, I know exactly where that bunker was and what it was there for. The first bunker we ran into... I knew it looked familiar. I just didn't know what it was. Now I know. Wait a minute. Did we just circle all... I think we circled all the way around the map. We did. Now it makes sense. No way. No way. Yeah, okay. So this is new. 
The old gas station I was referring to is one we've already been to. We've literally went all the way around the map. I want to confirm that by going down the road here and seeing if the other gas station is here. It's either that or they've got multiple of those hotels. No, this is it. Yeah, we went in a full circle. Because here is the old gas station. See, I knew, like, I was like, man, this gas station looks familiar. Now I know. This is, this is literally the old gas station. With some, you know, new modeling done to it. I'm such an idiot. Okay, then the barns should be down this dirt road. And that's straight through the middle of the map. All right, I know I know everything now. I'm a master at this game. I've already defeated it. Almost just fell through the map. <laughs> okay, let's go find these barns. Oh my god, look at this glitch. I'm running, but you can also see my hands on the cart. <laughs> That is so crazy looking. We turned into uh, Virginia. All right, this is the last place I wanted to see and we've already ran past it, which I didn't realize we had run past it because I'm stupid. Uh, the barns we also ran past. <laughs> didn't realize it, but uh, yeah. So I think we've literally seen everything we're gonna see. Somebody told me too that they're merging the maps. So the old map and the new map are going to be a thing. I don't know. Uh, if that's the case, then we should be able to run off of this map onto the other map. And I remember it was, it was like the end stages when they were updating the old map. There was like a whole new section that opened up after you beat the game. And then they just like completely reverted to that new map and just ditched everything. Why they did that, I have no idea. But I don't know, it's like, this game's path is so confusing, it just kinda doesn't make sense to me. Like what are they trying to accomplish with this game? Usually when someone creates a game, they know exactly what they're doing. They have like a storyline, a path, or whatever. They have some sense of what they're going to do, like where the finish line is. Like the devs for this game and Infected, it's like, let's just make a game. <laughs> Who cares if it makes sense? Let's just make a damn game. Let's use the assets that we have and let's do what we can with it. I feel like that's the direction of a lot of survival games these days. It's like, hey man, let's make a game. All right, bro. Well, what do you want to make it about? I don't know. Let's see. Let's go in and play with some stuff. You know what I mean? It's a good way to learn. But like I said, man, this game has been in development for, God, five years, six years now. And I feel like we're back at square one. And if this is Unreal Engine, it certainly doesn't look like it. <laughs> Maybe they've just like loaded in the old map and then they're just going to like completely revamp it. I don't know. I have no idea. I'd like to get one of those ATVs started, but it doesn't look like we're going to have enough time to do that. I may do a second episode on this uh, this quote-unquote update or early release, whatever this is. If you guys request it, let me know down in the comment section if you want to see another video on this. We'll mess with maybe like the four-wheeler and run around the map more. Check out the nooks and the crannies, you know. But I'll leave that entirely up to you guys. Or, if you want me to wait and let the game update a little bit before we jump back in. It's up to you. Ooh, there's a church. I forgot about the church. And there's another military bunker on the church grounds. That's not good. There's another one of those big-ass blobs. I have a grenade, I think. Do I have a grenade? I do not. Oh, well. Oh, yes, baby. Yes. Got two more slots. Found a backpack. It's our first backpack. Backpack. It's our first backpack. I keep seeing a lot of propane containers around, so I'm assuming propane's going to be a big thing in this game. Maybe for flamethrowers. Hell, I don't know. There's a garbage truck. 
got to check out some of these houses, too. I want to shoot something. Really bad. I got an itchy trigger finger. Pull out the shoddy. Come on. There's got to be something in here that I can pew pew. That I can pat 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 pat. Yeah, there's nothing in here. Work in progress area. What the hell? Wow, this is strange. That's cool, though. Okay. Whatever you say, dog. Interesting. That piqued my interest. Let's check these houses. Hopefully we'll find somebody that we can pap pap. Hello? Would anybody like to get pap pap papped? Come on. Got a lot of bullets. I need to spend them. I want one of these, man. You know what this is? This is a Buick Regal, dog. It's one of my favorite cars ever, dude. I love Buick Regals. They're so dope. We'll have one soon. Need to find Rachel. I want to see what she looks like. I went ahead and I left my cart behind. It's okay. We don't need it at the moment. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God. I missed. I missed. I won't miss again. There's another one in there. <laughs> the ones with the long hair, dog. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, the ones with the long hair, man, are trippy, dude. Quit growling at me, sir. Oh my god, that's the second time he dodged me. No more shotgun, man. Where'd he go? Come on, man. This guy is playing some games with me. That is the second time he dodged me. There we go. You ain't dodging that. Let's see what these dudes have. Oh, get my shotgun jails back, boy. All right, nice. Let's pull the shoddy back out. Just in case. You know what I'm saying? Close encounters, you know? It's empty in here. I think that's my favorite thing about this game. Shooting stuff. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but yeah, man. I mean, if you really think about it, it's like you hit a wall in this game because it's, there's like nothing to work towards, really. It's like it's just non-stop looting, killing, looting, killing, looting. Like I said, this game's never, like, never really had direction. I don't know. I'm not pooping on it. I understand how hard it is to make video games. Ah, see? We're back here. Oh, my God. How did I not recognize this place? I guess because I'm stupid. Whatever. But anyway, yeah, so you set up a homestead, you build, and you build, and you build, and you, survive, and you survive, and the mist comes and goes, and, you know, it's just like, I don't know. It's fun for a while, but, and we're definitely going to do it again, for sure. But again, let me know down in the comment section if uh, you want me to play this again, do another episode. I can't do a full series on it because the game is uh, still in testing mode, I guess you could say. But yeah, all in all, I am excited. I wish the devs all the luck in the world. And I usually say this in every episode. You don't have to. You're free-range humans. You can do as you please. But I would be humbled if you hit the subscribe button. And you don't have to hit the notification bell. Just a subscribe will do. And if you like the video, maybe like it. You don't have to, though. I love you guys. Thank you so much for making it this far. I'll see you in the next one.